bubbles. In today's video, I'm gonna be building a house out of the money I make within five minutes at the minor job. And no, I don't mean like minor as in like under 18. I mean like physically digging in a cave, low key kind of Minecraft, I'm not gonna lie. So without further ado, sit back, relax. <laughs> and enjoy the video. Welcome to the mysterious Bloxburg cave. I have not met a single person who actually works here, but today we're gonna change that. Ooh, spooky, spooky. I'm like running in fear. What have I signed up for? Loki, the walls kind of fairy light. Like the devs Loki added fairy lights in this cave. It's kind of aesthetic, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Our fit is Loki ugly. Why do I look like a watermelon? <laughs> what even is this texture? This person wears it so much better than I do, man. Anyways. Hey Siri, set a five minute timer. Nope. Okay, we're starting. So I think for this job, you actually have to find diamonds and stuff. Oh my gosh, I was doing it wrong. I was doing it wrong. I was doing it wrong. This already started. I was clicking mine instead of actually like digging in a hole. So unlike, oh, I was gonna say unlike Minecraft, I'm just gonna dig straight down, but I'm really glad I didn't do that. If you didn't know if you actually mine that TNT, you will explode. This is low-key kind of boring footage. This is literally just me banging my head against a rock. I'm gonna dig myself a little home. That way, if the home I build from this money sucks, I can always come back and live here in the mines. <laughs> this would be a great place to hide away from fans. Not that I'd wanna hide from you guys or anything, but hypothetically I could come hide down here and nobody would ever know. Okay, we have three minutes and 30 seconds left and I've already made around 600 bucks. So I'm hoping we reach at least 2,000. Okay, well I found some, what would this be, copper? And it gives you a little more money than the other stuff. Oh, I got promoted. Okay, yeah, I'll take it. We've reached $1,000 and we have two minutes and 30 seconds left. So we're basically halfway there. Oh, that TNT Loki a jump scare. <laughs> New sound dropping on SoundCloud. I'm in the mines and they don't define me. I'm gonna make money to build my house so I'm a rich man. Yeah, that's it, that, that's the song. <laughs> Oh goodness, we have less than one minute. Guys, I'm literally gonna fail this challenge. Like, I'm actually gonna fail this so hard. I'm gonna fail this so hard. Come on, we gotta at least have 2,000. Come on. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and we're done. Okay, we made $2,204 within five minutes, where if you think about it, five minutes, that's not a bad paycheck. I mean, if this was real life, that would be actually insane. I would quit my YouTube job and I would go die in a minefield. But I'm telling you, $2,000 is not gonna be enough for me to build a house. So this is gonna be quite the challenge. Also, are we gonna mention the, the elephant in the room? Or should I say um the burger in the room? I'm currently filming this on April 1st. So Mr. Blacksburg played us a little, um, little tricksies on us. That also gives you an idea of how far behind my videos are. I'm actually moving out when this video is being dropped. So I had to pre-film my like, funny video. It was a lot of work. <laughs> You know, an update I would love to see is the ability to give yourself a budget. Because every time I do this challenge, I have to do the math to see how much I'm allowed to use. Because obviously I can't like calculate up every single item. But luckily for me, I'm a math whiz. Or more so a series of math whiz. And you know, I'm like Einstein. I got this. Okay, without further ado, let's just get started. We're gonna build very simply. I mean like simply. That's literally my first name is simply. Simply bubbly. Thanks for asking. Like, I already feel like I just used too much money right here. <laughs> Should we use the broken front door? This is sad. We could also use this door frame and save 20 bucks. I can't believe it's a little more money to buy a broken door, but I'm gonna start with just the door frame. <laughs> What has the world come to? We definitely need some flooring that is a necessary item. I guess it's not really an item. What would you consider flooring? It wouldn't be like a possession, would it? Like an item? So for the bathroom, I'm actually just going to leave this open Wait, right there. What? Instead of having to spend money on another door frame. Bruh. But hey, you have some privacy. You know those really fancy like ensuite bathrooms in people's bedrooms where like there's not even a door. Like it's connected to the main bedroom. Imagine that, you know, really fancy living. So we saved 90 bucks by using the broken toilet. And we can even get a wall-mounted sink for $80. Wow. I'm loving this new trash update because it works really well for budget build. Because I can just change this and boom, it's a glossy sink because I'm changing the texture. I'm just going to leave it kind of ugly for now and come back to that later. We will need a shower though. Ugh, this is difficult. I don't even like the layout of this place. 
Oh, goodness. We need a roof. But I'm not going to paint these back walls yet. I'm going to leave that if we have the extra money. So for the roof, we're going to use this really simple one. It feels like I just joined Bloxburg and I'm trying to build a house. Like, ugh. This is really embarrassing. We need a little bit of gardening. So I'm just gonna put like two plants. Oh, no, 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 no. Guys, I'm gonna get disconnected. I can't press the back button. What's going on? Oh, what just, okay, well now it's all back. Wait, no, I just like, what's going on? Bloxburg, I know it's April Fool's and all, but well now I can't go back on what I undid. This build is really going well for me, as you guys can tell. We're gonna have to check off all the major items that you need, like a bed. First off, we could sleep on an old mattress just for 50 bucks. We could also put like this wooden slat bed. It's a wee bit expensive, but I've never actually used this item yet. So get some windows for some nice Natural lighting. I think we have about thousand dollars left in use. <laughs> I hate this. I really do. Why did I put myself in this situation? Last time I did this, I did the janitor job and I gave myself 10 minutes. And then while doing it, I was like, oh, this is so much time. Like, I'm fine. So I thought that this time I should just do five minutes. But that was not very logical of it. I mean, logical, logical. Love is never logical. I know I'm not responsible. Oh, a broken stove. I wonder if this broken stove actually works. Most of the stove top still works. And who needs an oven anyway? At this price, you simply can't say no. Yep. Well, I can't say no. I just got a whole oven for half the price of the normal one. All I gotta do is just change the texture and boom. Basically the same thing. We still need something to entertain us. Yes, sir. We could buy this broken down television. Or we could buy a bookshelf, honestly. Let's go back to the good old days when kids would read books instead of being glued to their little cellular devices. Actually, please stay glued to your cellular devices because that means you're watching my videos. So please, binge my videos. I would be honored. Don't read a book, by all means. <laughs> Actually, go read a book. That would be good. Nice. Oh my gosh, we could buy like an $80 cylinder cinder block bookshelf. Oh, look at these cute crates. Okay, actually, I'm going to save that for later. Bruh. If I really want it, I'll come back to it. Oh my gosh, books are expensive. So we're just going to buy these plain two books. Okay, we're working with just a few hundred more dollars. But I added this chest of drawers in here because I figure it would be important if people were able to, you know, customize their character. I am curious though, do people call it chest or drawers or a dresser? Because I call it a dresser, but I know some people call it a chest of drawers. Like that sounds very British to me. I feel like that's a British saying. Also, we should probably add some lighting. This doubles as decor and an actual light. And then we'll get a plain light bulb over here above the bed. I'm just gonna go through the all stuff and look at what's cheapest. We could get a chair over here for just 20 bucks, good. which is a steal of a deal. We could get a paper bag. <laughs> oh, we could even get ourselves a side table. <laughs> eh, it's not worth it. Okay, well, since we have a little more money, I think we should buy a shower. <laughs> I was thinking they could just wash their hands and go all day. <laughs> but when I really think about it, a shower is a pretty nice thing to have. What do I want to spend my money on? I might change the front door. Hold up! And that concludes the build. Let me give you guys, um, I don't want to say a grand tour because I feel like that's not very suitable for <laughs> what this is. Let me just give you guys a tour. That's all it is, really. Will you come inside my house? Not that you really could oh, no. because there's really no door knob. But if you like shove your way through somehow. You were greeted I'm by dying. um a non-able to use stove <gasps> because I forgot a fridge. Okay, I actually have to fix that. Like that is actually a problem. Um, you're gonna starve to death. Fridges cost a whole 500 Holy bucks. Geez. Oh wait, actually I could get a cooler. I could get a cooler. Not all hope is lost. We're gonna sacrifice a few things for this cooler. First off being, do we really need this book? No. Do we really need this bag? No. Do we really need this chair? No. Do we really need this window? No. What else could I dispose of other than the body in my basement? Huh? Everything else is kind of necessary. You know, I think this shelf is gonna have to go bye-bye and we're just gonna have some books chilling on this dress over here. Okay, we're back within budget. Now let me give you tour 2.0. So when we come inside my very cozy home, you can actually just only take quick meals, which means you can't even use this dang stove still. This stove was just a waste of money, but it's for looks. Bruh. We have a bed, which gets you to sleep up. We have a dresser so you can change your outfits. And we have all of your hygiene needs and these books. So since all my levels are so low, I can actually get my fun up very slowly Boring. by reading. I can actually eat some applesauce and get my hunger up. 
I can actually go to bed and uh, think about the fact that I'm broke. <laughs> and I can actually get my hygiene up in my very luxurious <laughs> modern shower. So would I call this challenge a fail? Yes, yes, I would call this challenge a fail. But you gotta give it to me. I mean, I was level nine working as a minor. And yet again, I do not mean working as like a minor, like illegally underage. I mean like literally. Getting my hands dirty for you guys. So if you'd enjoyed this video, please let me know in the comments below. And if you have an idea for future videos similar to this one, please also let me know. Thank you all so much for watching today's video. Leave a like and subscribe for more. And I'll see you all later. Bye, my beautiful bubbles.